the Zoram People's Movement under the leadership of former IPS officer Laldu Homa will form the government in Mizoram. Laldu Homa, a distinguished figure in the Christian-dominated state's politics, began his career in Goa before taking charge of Prime Minister Indira Gandhi's security in New Delhi. After leaving the IPS, Laldu Homa founded the ZPM and entered the Lok Sabha in 1984. However, his journey was marred by disqualification under the anti-defection law, both as an MP and later as an MLA. Despite these setbacks, he continued to build his political presence, culminating in a victory in the Sardship constituency by election in 2021. Mizoram's political scene has long been a battleground between the Congress and the Mizo National Front, with the MNF ending Congress's decade-long rule in 1998 under Zoram Thanga. While the MNF and Congress alternated in power, the ZPM emerged as a formidable challenger, especially after gaining official recognition in 2019. ZPM's rise in popularity has been attributed to factors like anti-incumbency, underdevelopment, and the MNF's unfulfilled promises from the 2018 elections. Mizoram is facing financial crisis, and the financial condition is very bad. That is what we are going to inherit from the outgoing government. In spite of this, we are going to honor our commitment. After swearing in, we will announce our top priorities for the next, for the next coming 100 years. Despite being disqualified again in 2020 for violating the anti-defection law, Laldu Homa's recent electoral success underscores his and ZPM's growing impact in Mizoram. Interestingly, Mizoram remains the only state in the Northeast not governed by the BJP or its alliances.